The frigid weather is prompting utility companies to issue peak alerts now. They're asking customers to conserve where they can without risking health or too much comfort. 10 TV's Chuck Strickler is in Licking County tonight with more on how they're doing that. Well, we're actually in what we call our war room. Todd Ware and his staff at the Energy Cooperative are closely watching the latest information coming in from their network of sensors, tracking the usage of thousands of electricity customers. This top line is tomorrow. And you can see how much different is projected for tomorrow, and obviously that's the weather that's coming. The white line is projected power usage for tomorrow, and that's the reason why a peak alert is going out for Tuesday between 7 and 10 in the morning. Basically, an appeal to customers to conserve energy. What we're trying to do is keep our uh, demand down, because what we're trying to do is ask them, hey, you need to help us so that we can help you to keep this bill down. Another way to stay below that peak level is by implementing what they call a load control adjustment. Those controlling the flow of electricity will actually turn off customers' water heaters remotely during the peak time with the help of this special device attached to the water heater. Jack Schmidt is a cooperative board member and customer and has one of those attachments. They are voluntary and those who have them get an additional rebate. Unless we come down and look to see that the switch is activated, we don't miss the, having the, the electricity. It's occasionally we'll get a call where somebody will say, hey, I had a cold shower and I don't like it. But generally, people don't notice it. Chuck Strickler reporting there. The Energy Cooperative serves 24,000 electricity customers, but also 30,000 natural gas customers. Now, one important thing you can do to keep your family safe is to make sure the ice and the snow cleared away from your gas meter. This will help prevent any dangerous fumes from getting into your house. Again, the cooperative is asking customers to cut back on their energy use tomorrow from 7 till 10 a.m. and possibly again from 6 to 9 tomorrow night.